Hello friends and comrades, it's me, a time traveler that goes to a future where everything is just slightly worse. And welcome back to Ostrith, where we just time travel to a future where everything is just slightly worse. But a few more houses have been built. We have finished all the construction projects except for the church, because I thought that would be something that I want to finish in a video. And, uh, yeah, we finished building these guys over here. We got the tannery and the shoemaker's workshop. So what I think I'm going to do is, um, tell me about this thing, batches. Choose the amount of hides in one batch and the amount of batches. Oh, that's really cool. That's pretty cool. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to assign one worker here. We're going to say, um, you know what? We're going to say off, off season one, on season three. Uh, but I want this to be that. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, yeah, welcome back. We, we let the whole thing happen for a while. And, uh, well, what did we figure out while all the buildings were being built? A couple things I have to say. Number one, uh, we seem to have enough food. That's good. That's good. But I did notice that every now and then it did pop up a little bit that people were missing water so i want to add a couple wells around town and we're just gonna squeeze this these in uh wherever there's space like for example around here there's a little bit of space for a well seems perfect to me so let's put that in there and we'll just put it over in front of the church uh i want a well on this side as well a well as well all's well that ends well uh, and another thought that I had which would be a good idea I think is to actually build a forestry on this side of the the river you know and that way we don't have problems with having to wait forever to cut these trees because oh my god did it take forever but I think this will be good you know a forestry right here and these guys will help speed things along and again that's gonna go in front of the church so that's good uh and i also wanted to add a well up in here i don't think okay we have a well there where's the closest well to here doesn't really exist very close by so i thought that we could add a well mm, just in the shadow of this building that could be an idea or somewhere where it's you know nothing else is gonna go so maybe in the back here uh, just like that. Cool. So that's what I want to add. And today what we're going to do uh, is we're going to embark on this. Uh, upon this, we're going to we're going to see we're going to endeavor to create a beautiful market. I was thinking how what do we need for a market? So uh, let's just let's slow the game down while we think about this. So the markets can sell a couple things they can sell as far as I can see 18 different things and a single market sells four so I thought we would do five or six markets just so that it's a nice little spread and there are certain things we can I think sell in doubles you know like the most common food like potatoes and so on so maybe six markets so that it is uh, nice and uh, nice and symmetrical and there are certainly certain things that don't sell as well, I think. Like clothes don't seem to sell that much. But you can see, we can, you know, basically compare from these markets. We can see what sold the most and what goes the fastest. And we can double those things up. Same here in the back. I think what we're going to add is another similar market to this one. And we're just going to, because this is 16 slots. So that means two things aren't being sold. So there are certain things that, I guess there's going to be two things that aren't going to be available in this market. And two things that aren't going to be available in this market. Or, you know, it'll be over here somewhere. And that should still make it, you know, nice for people. If they really want something, they can just walk slightly further out. So that's a thing um, over there. And I actually wanted to add that extra market here just to make sure that in this central one, we have everything covered. And we can do a little different uh, pattern maybe. Oh, those are the only patterns that we can get. Okay. I guess, uh, 
Oh, look at that. That's lovely. We'll, we'll go with that one. I guess, yeah, we'll just... You know, this place, I like it to be a little bit chaotic over here. So that's why it's like this. So, um... These, it's a little bit annoying that these are in no particular order. But let's just see what's missing. I'm gonna say shoes are missing. So we're gonna go shoes. And then there's one thing that's missing still. How are we gonna figure that one out? Well, I guess we could just go down the list. Beef, buckwheat, buckwheat, chicken egg, chicken meat. Feel like all of these are in. Firewood is in. What do we think is missing? What do we think is missing? Horse meat? I'm gonna guess horse meat was the one that was not being sold anywhere. There we go, we got it. All right, then let's just add, firewood sells a lot. But I wonder if that's just because we have a lot of firewood available or what's going on. Let's just take a look. Firewood spent, a lot of firewood is being spent. A lot of firewood is being sold. Um, ba -ba -da -ba. you know what? Potatoes. Potatoes. Everybody's eating potatoes. Everybody seems to be, well, they're not happy eating potatoes, but I will leave the last one empty. We can leave the last one empty. That's fine. Uh, also, just to, just, we're just going to say just hire women. Apply to all. They're all just going to hire women. Just because I feel like um, we did have a little notification that there are fewer jobs for women during the winter, which is fine. I mean, it's not fine. It's not fine at all. Um, right, so here's what I'm thinking. We can sell clothes in this one, and then we're, we're going to skip shoes and maybe horse meat. So everything else we got to be selling... Buckwheat, potato, chicken, egg, sunflower oil. Why are we not selling chicken meat? So let's add uh, chicken meat. Are we selling dried fish or fish in general in this part of town? This one is selling regular fish. We're just selling dried fish. Okay, so firewood, flour. Are we selling flour? We're selling flour. Okay, this is going to be a little bit more annoying. Um, honey. Are we selling honey? We are selling honey. Um, let's continue going down the list. So we're gonna skip horse meat. Pork. Stalo. These, these are the ones I'm gonna say. And salt. That's what I'm gonna say we don't have anywhere else. Great. I don't know how we produce salt. We'll figure that one out. So that's the thing. So one thing that I figured out was that uh, while the planting of everything seems to work fine, the gathering of things did not work as fine. So uh, what I'm guessing, and also the growth didn't complete. So what I'm guessing is that it just means that they were sown so late that they didn't get to grow all the way. Um, things seem to be plowed okay. Plowing does not seem to be the problem, except for this one, it might be. Uh, that's a little bit of a concern. Because it's already... Well, I guess it's still March. But yeah, see, these are already being sown, but it's... It's, like, so many workers are... Oh, we, we need a lot more workers, is basically... has been the theme song of this entire town, has been. We need more workers. But we are at least plowing these, which is good. Uh, and yeah, so once these, uh, these wells were all built, that's good. Hopefully that's not going to be a problem anymore. Let's try to establish a little market. And I do think we might end up going with, with six, uh, stalls. So that's the thing, right? So we need, we need the, the, we need this stuff. I, I talked about that. Uh, and the other thing that we need is obviously a granary. Now, there is more than a single granary can take. So I was thinking we might just go with two granaries, right? Wait, how many slots does a granary have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. But this, um, this is just nine things here. Maybe because we don't have all the things. I'm going to guess it's because we don't have all the things. Um, but the markets can sell, as we've discussed, 18 things. Now, some of these go into um, storage instead of a market, right? 
Uh, and that would be clothes, firewood, and salt. Does salt go? I think salt goes into a warehouse and shoes. So maybe a single warehouse should be enough. Let's see. Wheat goes into a thing, but wheat doesn't get sold there. Salt also looks like salt doesn't go into a granary. So what I'm saying is one warehouse, two granaries, I think, is what we're going to need. Uh, and in fact, what I think, we could have two warehouses, one with um, maybe some nails and stuff as well. And another one with with all the other stuff. That's this. I didn't say that very well. I didn't explain myself very well. But essentially, let's build a little center here. Uh, now we're, I'm gonna keep the speed low. It's not like they're gonna go build it, but it's gonna take a while to plan this all out. And that's what we're doing today. Um, so. Yeah, what I'm thinking we're going to start with is... I would actually like to clear these trees out, but no, 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 no. Uh... Why don't we just start with fences? What's the prettiest fence? Let's figure out what the prettiest fence is. Uh, na, 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 na. It's fence number one. Ooh, I like number two. It's tall, it's kind of nice. Number three is kind of lame. Okay, number four is the prettiest by far. So I think we're gonna go with number four. Can I please? It's very difficult to select. Yeah, we're gonna go with number four. Uh, and... I'm thinking... Hmm, maybe we don't want to start with a fence. Maybe we just want to start with the markets and then go from there. Okay, let's just start with... Let's give them something to do in the meantime, because I'm noticing that thing still doesn't have its trees cleared and that's going to take a while. So maybe we can just slap in one last building here. So there's a way through. And there should be a way through here. But here's where we're going to start wedging in that little market. So what I'm thinking is, let's start with storage and transport. Uh, granary has, okay, it turns that way. So, granary here. Oh, let's put that there. A granary, oh, I don't like that. We're going to be a little bit meticulous with this one because I do want it to look nice. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you want to put in a little bit more extra effort just to make your thing look nice. So, I'm going to say granary. And then there's going to be one on the other side. But before we get to that, um, we're going to go into a big market. So, market stall. And we're just going to use this design for now. I don't know how we're going to separate them. Maybe we'll make them look different. Uh, but I think we could basically... Have... Let me just look at this one for a second. I like this one. You know, it's nice. It's got benches. It's got a well. It's got all the things. It's got... It's got what it takes. <laughs> And here, if we're trying to make it symmetrical, I would say, oh, we could also go wild and just have way too many market stalls. But I don't think we need to go wild and have way too many market stalls. I think we could go... Ultimately, we could also go with five. Um, so originally what I was intending to go with was three like this and three like this. But since we might be incorporating the granaries into it, let's take a look. Uh, da -da 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 -da. We could do, if we do three like this, it's going to be a little bit of a problem because I don't know how I'm going to pull off the symmetry. Uh, alternatively, it could just be something like one. 
two, three. And then on this end, also one, two. Oh, I let go of shift a little bit too early. Three. Oh, that one could go slightly further back. I like that these ones build instantly. It helps me. It helps me with my indecision gene. Oh boy. Hell yeah. All right. So it's not the most the prettiest thing yet. Uh then what I would like is let's make it big arches. Big arches, big arches on both ends. Or small arches in the back, big arches in the front. I could do something like that. Or one big arch. Mm -hmm. Let's do small arches. Let's see what that looks like. Because after the arches, we've got fences going on. I think these ones might be a little bit too... No, it's good. It should be good. So that's this bit. Um, and then let's talk about wells. I'm thinking maybe we'll do like two wells. What if a well goes like that? Does it fit? It doesn't fit. The wells are such a weird shape. Isn't this a weird shape for a well? Okay, I'm thinking maybe like this. And then in the middle, what what goes in the middle? What what nice thing can we stack in the middle? <laughs> a hay rack. Of course. The prettiest of things. How much is a chapel? You know what? We could make a chapel in here. I don't think that would be fully a miss. That would be fully a problem. And then let's go on with the with the other side. So we've got granary and we'll do another granary on this end. Granary, oh granary's under here. Granary. And now we didn't put warehouses anywhere, but my guess is we could just put them on the outside. Like, you know, on this side of the road, across the street, because we do want to break the, the house, the row of houses a little bit. so. You know, we might as well just put a little granaries over here, or warehouses. And I'm thinking, because it seems like... Maybe like this, and then just give me... Uh, FF. Just like this. And it'll look like it's one long one. I don't know how I feel about that, but... Uh, yeah, we'll see. we'll see what that ends up being like. Okay, now let's go back to decorating. Um, also, let's speed let's speed things up now. Now we've got. I feel like we've got what we wanted. We'll we'll move the church to the back. Uh, let's go into the fences, right? So we said fence four. Uh, now here's where it gets tricky because maybe we want to connect the fences to the thing, in which case it's time for more arches. Oh yeah, we could just be arch city in this on this end. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna fully go in there. I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna say from here to fully this granary. Like you can only access the granary through. The market. 
iron on this side as well. I do wish that we incorporated the warehouses a little bit better, but you know what? You can't have it all, apparently. <laughs> I kind of thought like, oh, I'll figure out where I'll put them, but then the, the, the granaries ended up being so neat, so cool, I just went with the granaries the way they are. Okay, now, uh, I would actually like to have all of these buildings up so that we can place those benches down, so that would be nice, but we can already have some trees have a nice little row of trees. Hold on, let's see what's it like on this end. Yeah! You know, we could just go one, two... Oh, maybe that one's a little bit too close. I'm thinking three trees, or is four better? Too close to another tree? Alright. Uh, oh, damn it! You can't just cut it down? Oh, you can. Okay, remove. Okay, you can. Okay, okay, okay. And we'll do the same on this end. One, two, and three. I don't like that, um... I don't like the way that the, the fence comes on this end, so we'll we'll fix that a little bit. Let's make it a little bit nicer looking. Um, yeah, small arch. Let's just try to really correspond to what's going on with these. Oh, a person. Uh, you know what? I'll buy all your nails, as always, and all your iron and all your charcoal. You supply us with all these things. Can you give me a demographic breakdown of our wealth? Oh boy, we've got some people who've got zero wealth. I guess maybe because they just moved in? Um... But yeah, there are some very rich people, and I've been thinking that you know, we could just uh, try to increase the, change the financials a little bit. Oh, this, mm, in the back, it's a little bit awkward. So what I originally thought was that the markets would be completely separated from everything else, like this. But then, you know, the, the whole, the granaries happened, and now I'm like, oh, but this. Maybe we'll just do it like that. Too short. Ah, damn it. Maybe like that. It has a little wing. And we'll see if we can do the same thing on this side. Let's see, on this side it looks kind of nicer. It actually follows this thing. It has a wing on this end and it doesn't on this end. That is a little bit annoying. It's just because we were too ambitious with the way that this bit bends over. <laughs> bends over. Bends. You know, that it bends. The bend was too ambitious. Let me know in the description if... Or not in the description. Let me know in the comments if you've ever had an ambitious bend. Um, but yeah, yeah. I feel like it'll look so nice. You know, it'll have these trees hugging it on the outside. Trees hugging it on the inside. Trees everywhere. There's a lot of tree hugging. And we all know I love tree hugging. Blink. I'm just gonna go all out with these trees. Oh boy. Mistakes were made. Miscalculations were made. Is that about the same? Four here, four here. Oh boy. 
put three on this end. Yeah, you know what? I feel like it needs to be like three on the that end and they're slightly further out and four on this end and they're throughout the whole thing with one in the middle. And once the buildings inside are made, actually, we're going to do these guys first. Uh, I think this will be such a lovely little market. And uh, also what I would like is another farm here. Just because I just feel like that's, uh, that's what's needed is a farm. And then if we make this arm, we can add another cow shed. <gasps> oh, yes. So that and um, a cow shed. Kind of want you guys to touch almost fully. And then we can continue building more houses. With the houses facing uh, that way. No, why do I let go of shift? I keep letting go of shift. I hate it. And houses on this end as well. Oh, can we squish you in there completely? That. I like that. Okie dokie, Annie Oakley. It's not gonna be fully nice. <laughs> These houses are way further back. Okay, you know what? We are gonna try to make that a little bit nicer. Um, by making a house begin here. Yeah, I just want it to be like this. And we're gonna sort of bend into the field rather than the opposite. Oh, I clicked on that little magnifying glass by accident. Oh, the chapel is completed. <gasps> Look at it. Okay, so things are being done. Now we can add the... Now we can add the benches. A place to take rest. We're going to take these benches as well, because I think these are the nicest looking ones. Um, we're just going to add benches on each side of the chapel. I feel like that's not that sacrilegious to sit on the side of a chapel. Oh, it's got a little bit too much space on the sides, but it'll be good. It'll be fine. People are using the wells. That's lovely. Uh, okay, where, where are we sticking more of these benches? Could stick them on the side of the well like this. One on that side, one on this side. That kind of works, right? Uh, space is occupied. Come on. Okay, it's a little bit nicer on the side that doesn't have the, the entrance to the well. But, you know, what are you going to do? Once the granaries are done, I think we're going to add more benches to the side of the granaries. Oh, look at that. People are already resting. Okay, last final touches. Maybe some more trees. I kind of feel like those tall trees are the prettiest ones, the cottonwood ones. But maybe, you know, some other trees in the middle could also work. Ooh, we're like here in the corners. <gasps> oh, but it's too close to another tree on that side. Oh, no. 
No. Yeah, the cottonwood trees, I feel like, are the prettiest ones. Even though it, I think by now we might have gone into cottonwood overkill. Um, maybe next to the chapel. Oh, no. Very crowded, very crowded. But I do want some trees. So I'm thinking maybe on the... Like, in the middle of the well part. We'll see how that looks. Once the trees are grown, you know, that's the problem. You gotta wait for the trees to grow. Um, yeah, I feel like uh, it's probably good. It's probably good. Oh, look at that granary. Look at it. Okay, yeah. You know what? I'm. I. How are we feeling about this? Let's just, it's already been half an hour, but I just want to drag it out until the end of this construction. How are we feeling about this? Because I'm feeling kind of good about it. We are still plummeting, just straight up plummeting into debt. Import does represent a lot of our costs, but um, yeah, I think in order to start making money, we are going to have to start thinking about exporting stuff. But for now, I'm just, you know, I'm just happy to be making, to not be starving. We should actually check if people are starving. <laughs> we, we should just check that. Let's just investigate. Yeah, it seems like everybody's happy. No complaints. Pigs doing all right. Pigs are actually doing great. I think our slaughterhouse is pretty happy. We have a lot of beef. Um, can we store, can you guys, can you just talk to me, Granary, and you can maybe st start storing some of this. Ah, see, I, I see what it is. <laughs> I see you. It's, okay, okay, I understand. I understand how the, the numbers were working out on that one. Good. Good good yeah this is gonna be great this means that the granary uh we might actually need yeah we need we need exactly two granary well not exactly two but we're gonna be able to store all the things it'll be nice do we have two granaries on this side oh look at that look at that it's ready to make the can you just make two batches He's ready to make the leather. Gathering raw materials. He's gonna get the salt. Is salt something that we can sell as well? Is salt something that people buy? Yeah, salt is something that people buy. Maybe we wanna not sell salt. How do we get salt? Is there a production of salt? Or do we just have to keep buying salt? Lime works. Lime from quicklime and water. Clip quick lime from limestone and charcoal. We have that. What do we do with that? Can we only buy salt? Do we know this? I'm gonna look this up after the game. Let me just quickly note this down. Salt? Question mark. Nice. Oh, look at it. Look at it. It's so cool. Okay, okay, let's assign all the things. So I'm gonna say... I'm gonna go down the list from the top here. So, so we ended with milk, and I'm gonna... These are alphabetical. They are alphabetical. Thank Jesus Christ. Okay, here we're gonna go pork, potato, sallow, salt, Milk, sunflower, sunflower oil, and wheat. Do we want to be... Wait. Do we want to store sunflowers here, actually? Eh. Beef, buckwheat, chicken egg, chicken meat. Cloves, dried fish, firewood fish 
flour, honey, horse meat, milk, pork, potato, sallow, salt. I'm going to say shoes, sunflower oil, more potatoes, more firewood. Yeah, I feel like that's good. All right, let's assign um, these things apply to all. Assign some workers here. And I guess apply all um, of this as well. Apply to all. I mean, this is pretty simple. And we're just going to cancel you for now. There we go, you guys. Our little... Our little new market thing. It's gonna look a little bit nicer, I think, once the trees, you know, come into their own and they, they grow fully tall. And I think we can remove some of the surrounding trees as well, just to make it a little bit nicer. But overall, I'm pretty pleased with this. I am pretty pleased. You know what? That's what I'm gonna say. I'm 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 not displeased. Oh, you know what? Let's put another bench in the back. Bench. Call me Bench Apiro because I'm appearing benches all over. I wish we had some other decorations that we could put down. Like little lanterns. We could put them down here and here. I think that would look nice. Is there anything I can sneak in there? I don't think so. Well, I still think it's pretty lovely. It's so cool. It's so cool. Look at it in the snow. Oh, The trees are a little bit wonky, but what can you do? What can you do? Can we um remove this tree? And this tree? It's so cute! It's such a little marketplace. I mean, it's not really a little marketplace. I was gonna do something that's a little bit more of like a tiny marketplace, like the one that we have on the other side. But sometimes things just run away from you, you know? <laughs> You just lose track, and then suddenly everything is weird. Um, but yeah, yeah. Can we check on all the things that we own? Because I'm starting to think, like, maybe it's time to start exporting certain things. Drinking water, firewood. Hey, hemp. Hemp? We're starting to store a little bit of hemp. So maybe we'll be able to sell that. We got limestone coming in. Potato. Salt, thatch. Sallow. Okay, here's a question. Okay, we still have a bunch of open vacancies. Yeah, this will be perfect for these houses. Lovely. Lovely. I mean, it does only fill you know, like, five houses, that'll fill ten vacancies at most. So we should also start working here. Oh boy, more vacancies too. Um, yeah, you know what? We should start, we should start adding some more houses in this end. Just a couple. Just a couple houses. Place is occupied. You're ruining my j j jig. It goes out a little bit. It's a little bit wonky. We didn't think about that. We'll bring it back. We'll bring it back. We'll fix it.
But at least these guys can start removing trees, am I right? Uh, let's just uh, apply this to all. There we go. Lovely. Lovely gal. Oh boy, we went to 40 minutes. But it was worth it, I feel like. We, we added quite a bit of stuff. Oh, hey, baby. My cat's here. All right, that's the perfect time to, uh, let, let it, let, to, to just, to just let it go. Uh, to, to continue to the next thing. Um, oh, look at that. It's so cool. It's so cool. I'm, I'm really pleased with this. I have to say, I am very pleased with this thing. So, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna let them build all of these houses because, again, I don't think that building these houses, like, one, it's gonna take a lot of time, and two, I don't think we're gonna do a lot of gameplay in the meantime. I do want to fiddle with people's wages a little bit. Um, and then I will be seeing you on the other side. I love this, though. I love it. Look at it. Look at how good it looks. I think it would look even better if this was all houses. Because then it would be... It would be really cool. It would be really cool. I'm very tempted to just make it all houses. I guess we'll see if I've made that decision in the next one. Um, but yeah, thanks so much, folks, for watching. If you watched until the end, uh, there's some stuff probably on screen that you can click. You can check out my other videos. And remember, uh, if you like this video, feel free to do all the things that you do when you liked the video. And I will be seeing you in a future version of this situation. <laughs> I wonder if we're going to get to minus 20,000. We'll see. We'll see. All right, folks. Thanks so much. I'll see you later. Goodbye.